and your staff for putting on this, um, you know, this uh, great event uh, to really salute our student athletes first and foremost, but to a bigger extent to our obviously our coaches, the leaders of the team, and all the support staff that goes behind it. It takes many people to have a successful season, as uh, Coach Aran and, and uh, Laura would would testify to. It was awesome to see the team, the university, and the entire state uh, unify together uh, for. Um, for something that's uh, kind of bigger than themselves. I am proud on behalf of Lieutenant Governor Chan Tzu and myself uh, to proclaim March 28th, University of Hawaii Rainbow Wahine Basketball Day. Thank you to everyone who is here today. Um, I'm not gonna try to thank you by names and positions because I will just <laughs> screw it up. Um, but sitting here and having March 28th named Rainbow Wahine Day is um, overwhelming, and I, I, from my heart and from these girls, I just want to thank you for something so special. It doesn't happen any place other than Hawaii. Uh, there are too many other universities in other states, um, and not enough care that goes around. Um, as we were going through this journey as a as a team and as a staff, you know, we thought about what it was going to mean to the state. We thought about what we were trying to do as far as representing the people of Hawaii. And we definitely came up on the short side of our game against UCLA, but I remember walking in the locker room and telling the girls, I'm so proud of how you represented today, because you fought. Um, and I know the guys, you came up short against Maryland, but you fought and you represented a state and you made a lot of people very, very proud. There are very few things that unite a people, and I think athletics are one of those things that bring a people, a community, and in our case, a state together. And I am just so privileged and so honored to say thank you for allowing me to be a part of that. Um, and just uh, the excitement uh, overwhelms me. I would be remiss if I did not acknowledge my staff, because I will tell you, without them, none of this is possible. They are the ones that do all the, the hard work. On behalf of Lieutenant Governor Chan Tutsu and myself, it's an honor and privilege to proclaim uh, March 28th uh, University of Hawaii Rainbow Warrior Basketball Day as well. Um, number one, I want to thank everybody for making the time today. I, um, you know, as a person who studies the history of our program and takes great pride in the history of our school and great pride in the history of the state, I, I speak for all our guys on my right here, all our guys in our team, how honored we are to be in this special room and in this company. And um, just very appreciative of that. I'm very appreciative also of having the opportunity, one, for these guys to be celebrated as they should for what they've done, and two, for an opportunity for me in behalf of our guys to say thanks. And there's so many people to thank. As we all know, something like this does not happen without the contributions of everybody. And we are all one team. We represent one program, one state. And uh, just such an honor for me to, to be a, a small part of that. And I know I speak for our guys in that regard as well. Thank you to Laura Beeman for being so good to us since I got hired from day one. Just being very supportive. And uh, thank you to her team for being who you guys are. Very inspiring. But when you combine special teams with special support, you can do special things. And today, earlier, we got an opportunity to thank the students and the people at UH. And today, it's about the people in the state. Combine special student athletes, special leadership in the department, and special support with, with your students, and then with the state, and you have an opportunity to do some special things. I think that we're inspired to be where we're at today, but understand that there's an opportunity to do more. And it'd be exciting to see that happen. But again, I want to thank everybody here for honoring this group, these groups, and these people, and just very pleased and appreciative to just be a small part of it. So thank you.